Hey there Facebook, it is Vanessa here again and I am here to deliver an, a message for you guys all about how ethically stealing helps you to fast track your success and I really want to dive into this one and explain to you why this kind of came about. Um, it was really kind of funny. So yesterday, I'm just going to tell you a bit of a background story on it first um, and then I will be able to dive into deep um, into the depths of what I really 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 want to be sharing with you guys but yesterday I was um, sitting I was speaking with somebody who is currently just helping me out of the kindness of their heart um, with some things in my business and, and how I could be reaching more people and um, I was talking with him and he mentioned um, ethically stealing and I was like whoa 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 what does that mean like what's that all about and um, it kind of triggered my interest and it's why I really wanted to talk with you guys about what I was thinking so before I kick start I can see you've got Alexandria and Charles I love it I love that you guys are both here um, so so exciting and um, and so Really, if anybody who is listening or going to be listening to this replay and you don't know who I am, I'll just give you a quick little spiel. But I'm actually, Vanessa, I'm a, a speaker, an online trainer, and um, definitely a transformational coach. And I definitely dedicate my life to just helping people to uncover who they really are, what they really want, have the courage to live authentically, and um, to meaningfully contrib contribute what their genius is or what their gift is. So. I love doing that and that's why I deliver these messages but today's message is all about this ethical stealing concept and I want to share with you what that even means and how you can utilize it to ultimately fast track your success so one of the biggest things about um, you know we, we think about stealing and we think that's bad right but what the hell does ethically stealing mean and really what it's all about is fast tracking your success by not having to reinvent the wheel but instead tap into the beauty of humanity's evolution so we've evolved to the places that we are right now purely because people before us have discovered things and we've been able to build on their successes building build on their findings and actually expand what we do on top of that so Many people, um, you know, want to get a message out to the world. I speak to so many of you beautiful souls and that's part of my mission is to help you to uncover what your genius is, what your unique gifts are and give them out to the world, right? But one of the holdups I find people doing is that they are so scared of getting their own message out there because they're fearing whether people will think, oh, that person's stealing that person's idea and that person's idea and they're not being original and all of this stuff, right? So that version of their perception of stealing prevents them from getting their message out to the world and actually being of service. On the flip side, I see other people who are, again, not wanting to be seen as stealing anything, so they don't ever acknowledge where they get information or wisdom from, and they try and make it out like they, you know, they are the instigator of all this wisdom and knowledge, and they just came up with it all in their own brains and minds without any support or help um, or wisdom or experience shared from other people. So both of those versions of people are absolutely being driven by their fear of not being seen to be stealing. But ultimately, this is where ethically stealing comes into play. And I just love this concept. So ethically stealing is ultimately where you you know you gain wisdom and knowledge and um, you know all of that great stuff from people who have more experience than you you know they've they've um, done the work um, they're further along the timeline than you whatever it is but when you get that information and you take that on board you articulate it in a way that you absolutely give credit where credit is due for the people who you've learned from I think that's a beautiful part of it. And on top of that, you don't just stay with what you learn from other people and overvalue their knowledge and expertise. You take it to the next level by building upon that foundation and contributing your experience, your gifts, your way of thinking, your perspective to enhance what you've learned and what that wisdom is. And that's ultimately the beauty of humanity's evolution. 
and it's why ethically stealing is so valuable because when we can ethically steal it means that we are absolutely taking on board you know the the wisdom the experience from other people who've walked the path we want to walk on and learn the things that you know if we can take on board their lessons it means we don't actually have to go through it to be able to take that wisdom on our journey of evolution and we are absolutely um, you know giving credit to those people who've done that work and we gratefully appreciate them openly and communicate their messages you know this is another thing that people get held up on they think that oh people wouldn't want to want me to share that I guarantee people love people who are you know creating great in um, you know mindsets perspectives and lessons from their experience they if they're doing it from the right place from their heart they absolutely want you to share their wisdom with others and expand their reach and their message and their mission I love it when you guys share my stuff uh, you know that means the world to me because I am attempting to share you know a message that touches as many people as possible not not that it has to come from me but because it's valuable to you and you want to share that perspective with somebody else that you care about and share their um, you know expand and fast track their success as well you know and you know when we can understand ethically stealing and we can give credit where credit is due it gives us the freedom to therefore get innovative and you know add to what's already been created and discovered and that is how we can ultimately make the greatest impact to the world and meaningfully contribute with our lives you know if our lives have no meaning if we don't feel like our lives actually impact and make a meaningful difference in the lives of either just the closest people to us or the world at large on whatever scale it is ultimately we're never going to feel a true sense of fulfillment in our lives and so what with that knowledge in in hand and in heart we know that we can expand on what already is known rather than thinking we have to reinvent the wheel and come up with our own individual way um, to begin with which takes a hell of a lot of time um, and experience and years we can be more intelligent about it and definitely tap into the wisdom of other people who've definitely gone on that journey and then from there with that foundational piece in place where we're giving credit where credit is due to therefore expand on what's already known through our own unique gifts and genius and um, and definitely our experience so hoping that this is valuable to you guys and um, I definitely want to be checking in with you guys I definitely want to make sure that each and every one of you um, who is joining me today and I can't wait to say hi you're dropping me a comment um, you're definitely checking in with me giving me some of your perspective I always love hearing from you guys and um, and if these messages are of value to you guys I just want to reiterate that I would love for you to share them that is the greatest gift that you give to me and the mission that I'm on is to just share it out or tag somebody in these videos that you think will find it valuable I'd love that and um, I just appreciate having you guys here so let me check in I've got Alexandra and Charles like I said hey to it's so good to have you and Goppy's here and Sam's here and Jeremy and uh, Bob and Moises awesome and uh, Adnan and um, hello to you Jeremy and uh, Sam love the way you cr um, give credit to Martini and Tony Robbins yes absolutely they're two of my absolute greatest mentors and I wouldn't be where I am today if if I didn't come across their incredible work and so thank you Sam for recognizing that absolutely and um, uh, and I'm glad to share your wisdom and knowledge with gratitude and appreciation thank you so much Sam I so appreciate that that's so beautiful of you to say my friend and uh, awesome Alexandria so really that is my message for you guys I just hope it gets you thinking about not being too afraid to share the perspectives of other people that you're learning from out of fear that you're going to be seen as you're stealing their ideas give credit it is such a beautiful gift that you can give to people who are on a mission to you know add value to your life you know don't hold it back share it with others just give credit that's all you have to do and on the other side don't be so fearful of being seen as though you're stealing ideas that you just own everything like it's your own and you actually don't give any credit you know that's 
that's so infuriating to me. I find that one of the things that absolutely triggers me when people take on these, you know, ideas and concepts and share them as if they're their own, but they're not actually going, you know what, I've read this, or I studied this, or I did this course, or I heard this, and it was so amazing, this person, what they shared, and this is how it's triggered my thoughts. You know, that's so much better than being in fear of like not being able to acknowledge people or, you know, not being able to move forward and share what's valuable because you're too scared of people, you know, thinking that you're stealing other people's ideas. Just give credit. It's beautiful. And Marco's in the house. You were the instigator for today's message. So thank you, my friend. And um, guys, really, that is my message. I'd love for you to share any of my content that you find valuable. It would help me immensely on my mission and it would mean the world to me and I so appreciate each and every one of you guys who's tuned in who's here to um, you know check in with this message and um, just to reiterate my messages my Facebook lives I know so many of you guys have been following for so so long and I so appreciate each and every one of you you are the reason why I do what I do I'm shifting all my Facebook lives over here to my um, business page um, so that I can expand my reach to more and more people so I want to make sure that you guys have definitely liked the page and turned on your notifications because I had some messages from a bunch of you yesterday who said, what happened to your Facebook Live and I didn't see it and what's going on. So I just want to reiterate that to you guys as well. And um, as always, I'm sending you all of my love, light, blessings, gratitude, energy, enthusiasm, everything extraordinary coming to you to wherever you are in the world today. I hope it's beautiful, amazing and extraordinary just like you. And I'm super excited because tomorrow is um, the first initial launch of my eight week empowerment program. So I know a bunch of you guys are here, Sam and Alexandria and Jeremy, um, who are actually in the course. And it's so exciting. Tomorrow is day one, our very first training. And you guys are already rocking it with your homework that I've been or your empowerment assignments that I've been checking in on. So, so awesome. So much love for you guys. Can't wait for these next few weeks ahead. And if you're still on the fence, this is your last opportunity to come on board. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. I'll drop a link for it um, up above the video when I drop, drop off. Um, but definitely, definitely come and join us. Now is the time because we kickstart first thing tomorrow morning, um, um, Australian time. So Sunday evening, US and most of the rest of the world. So last chance, this is it. And can't wait to have you on board. I'm sending you guys all of my love and I cannot wait to see you guys tomorrow. So make sure you've liked the page, you've got your notifications on, you share this with anybody you find valuable. And um, I am sending you all of my love and I cannot wait to see you tomorrow.